Hey guys, Jake Burton here, and today we're talking about some things you might include in the quote drummer's survival kit. So we're going to go through kind of the stuff that I carry. Uh, first thing I carry in this Altoids tin, uh, this is just a little, they call it a ranger band, but uh, it's just a piece of inner tube I use to put around it just to keep it in place. Inside the Altoids tin, uh, we have some moon gel, an extra guitar pick in case somebody drops their pick, or uh, you know, sometimes a guitar player needs a guitar pick. I've had it happen, believe it or not. <laughs> uh, and some earplugs. So that's what I kind of carry in there. Um, I carry a pocket knife, just a basic pocket knife with a bottle opener. On here, I got that on Amazon, cheap. Uh, this is an extra piece to a hi hat clutch, extra wing nut, a couple of lug locks, and here's a bag of uh, earplugs. This is a little miniature crazy glue, um, super glue, in case you need that couple rolls of gaffer's tape, just mini rolls of gaffer's tape that I made. Uh, inside this little pouch I have um, a bunch of tension rods, both the 1032 and the 1024 so that will fit uh, DW or standard threads. I love this thing. Um, this is called the Gibraltar wing key and um, guys always over tighten their wing nuts downtown and I'm you know sometimes just killing myself trying to loosen them up so this will fit on the uh, top of the wing nut and then it also comes with a conga wrench which I've never used I don't play congas a lot and uh, a standard drum key there so this thing really has saved my butt uh, I always carry two hi-hat clutches a Yamaha size and then a lot of the gear downtown is Mapex so I bought one of these, and this is just a little Mapex, so that way you're covered on both uh, pull rod sizes. Sometimes you get hungry if you're doing a double, or if you're uh, on the road and need a little pick-me-up. There's a Cliff Bar I carry, Zildjian tool. Somebody gave me this as a gift, one of my students years ago, and I, I love this thing. Uh, it has a drum key on it, flathead, screwdriver, and then a bunch of hex keys or Allen wrenches. I carry a Leatherman Wingman, which has pliers, uh, wire cutters, flathead, file, Phillips, scissors, you name it, it's got all kinds of stuff on it. Good Leatherman tool. I also uh, sometimes carry the Leatherman Wave, which I love a lot. Uh, two pencils, two Sharpies, two is one, one is none. Uh, if you need to write charts on the road or make some notes in a recession or a uh, rehearsal or whatever. Two pieces of snare cord, two pieces of plastic snare cord. Or if you have different snares you're using, uh, a couple varieties of zip ties, cable ties. This is a basic first aid kit, triple antibiotic, some tape, cotton balls, Imodium AD if you get diarrhea, uh, uh, ibuprofen or Advil, moleskin, what else is in here? A couple band-aids, some BC powder, and uh, triple antibiotic band-aid, large band-aid. So just like a basic uh, first aid kit with some Advil in case you get a headache, you're not feeling well. Uh, this is not really necessary, but it lives in my uh, emergency kit. It's just a little one of those little Promark rattlers and I put a couple extra little rattlers on there in case you're doing, who knows, a recording or you're you know, doing a live gig and you feel like throwing that up, get a little different sound. I keep a bass drum um, patch in there. Now I love the Evans patches, I just but I like this large fiber skin one in case maybe you're playing one night and you're start, you're noticing you're starting to wear through the kick drum head this could save you if you put that on your kick drum head or or it could save a tom tom if, if you're busting through now do i bust their heads very often no but i have played before and i have uh, broken through a kick drum head believe it or not so knock on wood i hope that doesn't happen soon but this can save you in a pinch along with some gaffer's tape get you through the gig now that being said um, when I go on the road, I always carry two. Or I always carry a spare kick drum head. I don't bring the spare kick drum because obviously that's ridiculous. But I always throw an extra kick drum head in my case, and then I always roll with a spare snare side head and a spare um, batter head. And then most of the time, I'm carrying a spare snare with me too in another case. But uh, when I'm playing downtown, I always have two two uh, snare heads with me. I don't carry a spare snare downtown, just on the road, but um, if you break a bottom head, you're screwed. Um, I don't carry a snare strainer. I've never had a problem with that. Um, if one of the snare strainer, if one of the little snare strands breaks or something, you can clip it off with the wire clippers on here. Uh, if you have a problem 
with the cables, you know, on the snare strainer, you can use these to fix it. So that's, I don't typically carry a strainer. Uh, moving along, we have a couple of uh, hi-hat clutch felts, some basic felts, uh, good old wa uh, wash uh, cymbal sleeves, and some more cymbal sleeves here, because a lot of times you'll be playing, you show up, and I'm, luckily there's a guy in downtown named John Root who does an amazing job of keeping all the gear together, but sometimes you can go and play play other clubs, and we won't name them, um, and the, you'll show up and the cymbal stands will just be raw, <laughs> you know, just raw metal. So you put one of these guys on if you need to, or if you don't want that, you can use these. And um, these are different sizes. This is an 8 millimeter thread, and these are just non-threaded at all. So just a few different sizes of those. And that's it, besides a couple of extra sticks and stuff like that, which everybody has. But that's it. Hope that hope you gave, got some good ideas. One other thing here. Oh, I just keep my contact info in there, just like a little business card in case I do lose my stick bag or something like that. Somebody can contact me, and I keep one of those in my uh, symbol case, too. Just in case, just in case somebody wants to uh, be a good Samaritan, find my stuff, and give me a call. So, anyway, hope that helps. Have a great day.